Hey guys, it's Liz. Welcome back to another video. So in today's one, I'm gonna be showing you everything that me and my kids eat throughout the day. So this one's gonna be very casual, nothing too crazy, just some of our favorite recipes that we've been liking and hopefully you guys like them too. My kids are very picky and very simple eaters, so hopefully you guys enjoy that. Let me know what you think down below and with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the video. Alright, so for breakfast today, I'm going to be making some very simple waffles, you guys. These are so simple. They're kind of like similar to the banana pancake recipe, but they're in the waffle form. But surprisingly, the waffles are way more quicker in the morning because this thing makes it within like three minutes. So I'm going to be adding in one and a half cup of rolled oats to my Nutribullet. We're going to be blending this all together and then just adding a half a cup of milk. Any milk would work. And then I'm putting in one ripe banana, an egg, a half a teaspoon spoon of vanilla extract and a couple dashes of cinnamon and that is basically it we're gonna go ahead and blend all of this together And if your batter is looking a little too thick, go ahead and put in a little bit more milk and mix all of it together and it should be the right amount of consistency. And then I'm just taking my measuring cup and scooping that into my waffle maker. So I got this waffle maker at Target. It was actually on sale, so I got this for like 20 bucks. And this thing makes the waffles so quick, you guys. And this made eight small little waffles. And that was a perfect amount for all three of my kids. But hey, if you and your hubby are craving some waffles too, definitely double up this recipe if you're planning to make this for for the whole entire fam. So the kids like to have their waffles with vanilla yogurt on top, blueberries and bananas, but whatever fruit that we have, I'll just put on top but they really do like it with vanilla yogurt. I don't know, I randomly put yogurt on top of their waffle one day and they decided to call it sparkly toast and it's been a thing in our house. Oh my gosh, look how cute I look with short hair, guys. I gotta do that next. Maybe when I hit 30, that's when we'll go with the short hair. <laughs> but right now, it is almost like 10.30. Ember is going down for her first nap. And it is about time for me to make my first meal, which is breakfast. And also for the kids to have their first snack, which is an apple today. I like to get them these little tiny apples because they're so little and the older kids could just like wash it and just bite off the apple. But for Ezra, I do like to cut his up for him. So you want an apple, Ezzy? Or a cutie, because we got we got options here. Apple or a cutie? Because they're a little fruit basket. Apple. Apple? Okay. So I ended up giving him a little glob of peanut butter. So you have to be very careful, okay? So sit down and eat this. Did I give him? Let me see. Oh my god. <laughs> Bad mom, hey, spit that out, spit it out. No wonder my poor child, I forgot to take the core out. <laughs> I was like, that was like really crunchy. So for breakfast, I usually always make the same thing. It's either oatmeal or it's either like eggs with something else. So today I'm gonna make a wrap that I've really been enjoying. And I'm gonna be using these organic eggs that Eric got from his coworker. You guys see this? Like it's so cool, like just to see like eggs, like in its natural like form. She has, it's so she straight. has a coot or? She has goats, she has chickens. I don't know, it's so cool. But the green egg though, oh, I don't know about that green egg. I like that one, that's especially like <laughs> the money egg. <laughs> Did you ask her about that green egg? No. I would've been like, what's up with that green one? Like One of these still had a feather on it too. So, oh, it's oh, look right, at, there. Look right there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Get it closer. I was grossed out when he showed me that, but obviously it shouldn't be because that's where freaking eggs come from. Chicken's butt. So I also had Eric run to the store real quick because I really want to make salsa. Um, I love having salsa just ready to go because with anything we cook, we just like to have it, especially for breakfast though. I don't know what it is about salsa with like breakfast food. It's so good. So I'm going to make that a little later because this is going to take a little bit of time. It's not too hard, but I'll show you guys how to make it. But first, we're going to go ahead and make the wraps.
So to season the eggs, I'm just gonna use some sea salt. Oops. <laughs> was so rude. And some pepper. I like all pepper. Olive oil. Falling asleep in the stand. It's a long and just sprinkle some green onion all over that. If I had bacon, I would have put bacon. But... Oh my love, what's on your go ahead and take some of my vitamins and you guys know I take my ritual essential prenatals but they actually have a postnatal that I think I'm gonna switch to so I'm gonna finish these up and then I'll switch to their postnatal but then I like to take biotin for my hair to help grow it out and I'm just gonna be having this with some water and that is basically it Luke finally showed up to eat their apples you guys were gone for a long time what were you doing playing video games Ooh. That's what, huh? Mm -hmm. Your video game head Saturday, so they're over here having a lot of me time. You already had an apple, a little boy, remember? Mm -hmm. You didn't want to share his apple. <laughs> you want another one? Or do you want a granola bar? What about one of these? Okay, so he's going to have another one of these. He's going to snack boys, though. So. He's going to have a chewy bar of these. The kids love, for obvious reasons, because they have chocolate chips inside of them. So, you gotta sit on the table if you wanna eat this though, okay? okay? Like a big boy. And Ember's still sleeping too, so. All right guys, so it is about 12 o'clock now and this is what I've been doing recently because it's been so much, like, you know, I'm pretty sure you got parents could fill me out there, like making breakfast, lunch, and dinner for so many people every single day, you know, like when they used to go to school, we used to get breaks, you know, especially for lunchtime. But now it's been just like constantly having to make them stuff. So what I've been doing is cooking dinner a little bit earlier on. So for lunch, we'll have like a like two snacks. So like as you guys seen, they had an apple. And then if they ask me they're hungry um, anytime soon, I'm going to go ahead and give them another snack, but not a fruit or not like some veggie or fruit. And since I'm going to be cooking dinner right now, I'm actually going to be making them some chicken thighs, teriyaki style. So I have this sauce. And I'm just gonna be smothering the thighs with the sauce. So sometimes we would just like make the sauce by hand, but we've seen this in the store. We're like, oof, we're gonna pick this up because it comes with garlic, ginger, sesame seeds, soy sauce, and onions. Everything that I would put inside of my teriyaki sauce when I would make this chicken like without the sauce. But I seen this at the store. I'm like, yeah, let me get some of that. So this is what it's called. There you go. Um, and then I like to cook dinner like right now. So if they do get hungry, which I know they're going to get hungry soon, I'm just going to give them another snack and then I'll be like dinner's ready within like an hour. So that's what I've been doing to like give myself some break because it's just been so draining, you know, like super draining. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and put these thighs inside of my casserole dish, bake it inside the oven, and then I'm going to steam the rice and I'll show you guys how we do it. Putting some of this sauce, but I noticed this one doesn't have any honey in it and that's what makes the teriyaki chicken sweet. So um, does it have honey? No, it just says soy sauce. So I'm going to add a little bit of sweetness and put a little bit of honey inside of it. Putting it in a bowl.
All right, so Emma got hungry, so I just put her some hummus, and she likes the pine nut one, like this, uh. and just some of the crackers that we always get. And then for Ethan's snack, I'm gonna put some cream cheese and jelly on top of these Ritz crackers. So good. Actually, just jelly because we don't have cream cheese. <laughs> little jelly Mama, sandwiches. They're playing with the little. He's doing it. Yes, that's right. Ethan, here you want some jelly sandwiches? Whoa, if you guys haven't tried Ritz crackers great. with cream cheese and jelly, that's it's so great. good. But we don't have cream cheese, so we're just gonna do some jelly sandwiches that's for great. Ethan. What one, Chiquito? Hunter, Hunter. For another side, I'm gonna be frying up some broccoli. The kids actually, I know I. I like. Only Emma likes broccoli, but the other ones, I'll try to encourage them to eat it, but I don't know if they will. lunch dinner and perfect timing because they're already starting to get hungry <laughs> hearing that grinch in the background though um so yeah you guys literally like out of all the meals i make the kids love the most plainest meals so like going with like just chicken teriyaki chicken white rice especially white rice with like nothing in it they're obsessed so i try to make that for them like at least once a week because i know they will eat this up and it would just be like less of like hassling them to eat their food. You're hungry, mom. Mm -hmm. You better eat it. The broccoli's too. Did you go? You guys are wondering, we're having some of this Simply Watermelon juice. And what do you guys think? That this is a new flavor we were trying That out. tastes amazing. Ooh, good. Uh-oh, upper. But then we're gonna go ahead and eat the same thing too. And then after we eat, we're gonna treat ourselves because it's so such a snowy day, you guys. And we're gonna go to the Starbucks drive through and get some hot cocos. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna get coffee, and Eric's gonna get his free coffee. Ooh, I get free coffee. You better eat, Daisy. It's chicken or rice. Come on. So here's how much the kids ate. Ethan ate a lot, Emma ate a lot. But look at Ezra's! He had like zero of anything, so I'm gonna put his in the microwave and it's a good thing it's still early so that way he can have this for a little later. So we recently got a ring light and this thing is coming in handy because today like the light is like basically gone because it's snowing and it just like gets dark so much earlier now. But we went to go get some coffee. Um, so I got a tall iced coffee with some almond milk vanilla and a little bit of caramel drizzle we got it for such a cheap price oh and we also got two hot chocolates actually three hot chocolates Ezra's is right here but he fell asleep this is nap time right now so he's like he's knocked out on the couch right now Eric got black coffee and we got a discount because if you guys don't know this all healthcare workers get free coffee babe yeah free coffee free coffee but we just have to like pay for I think the the sweetener and all of that. So we got six dollars off off of our order. So, hey, yeah. you think you're cool now, babe? Where's mine? I want to take a sip with you. Oh, it's right there. My toaster also came in, so I ordered a toaster off of Amazon. We haven't had a toaster since we moved. I don't know what happened to ours, and then we went. I think we must have thrown it away. <laughs> you need a piece. And what did you get? Just boring. Okay. I it's no. super sweet. You yeah. you tell right. me that all the time it's and so I end up sweet. just like gagging. So smooth and sweet. I don't know how we could do that. No, you always it's tell me you always tell me this that it's smooth. They made it and then end up gagging on it. Just like when she looks at us when we're talking. 
I got a cute white toaster off of Amazon. I was in a, I was tied between cream, light Amazon. blue, or white, so I just went with white. I, I wanted cream. You wanted cream, but ah! Mm -hmm. Is that hot chocolate good? Mm -hmm. I like your chocolate face. Cute boy. <laughs> okay guys, so it is almost six o'clock now and I'm gonna make myself some oatmeal and the kids too. I only have about one cup though left of oatmeal so this is gonna be for me and the kids for just like a little late night snack dessert type of thing. And I like to make my oatmeal really simple and I like to add yogurt with mine so that's what I'm gonna do tonight. So, clean my hair up. Stop checking me out. Let me see those hungry eyes. <laughs> hungry eyes. <laughs> I like them really simple. So I'm going to add in one cup of oats, then two cups of water. It would be easier if I had one cup. But <laughs> then I'll show you guys like my yummy toppings because I like, I don't know, I like the way I make it. Now. I make oatmeal two different types of ways, but today I feel like having it with the yogurt. And then I like to use some of this Chobani Greek yogurt, and this is the plain kind. And then Ember is going to have like some oats with me too. She's going to eat her first little oatmeal. And then some blueberries, and we're going to do some chia seeds. Okay, and then I'm going to put in some peanut butter. And this one's really liquidy, so I like the way it goes on. Peanut butter. Butter. I'm gonna just mix it. I would add in chocolate chips, but I don't have any chocolate chips. Seriously, we realized we didn't have so much stuff. I wanted to make some like things, and then like we we're just out of everything. So, oh my gosh, <laughs> never mind. I totally forgot another ingredient. Usually, sometimes I use vanilla yogurt, but today I'm using like plain yogurt. So, you gotta add in some sweetener to that. So you're gonna need some honey. Mm. Okay, and now for the kids. Ezra didn't eat, so I'm pretty sure he's gonna have a good amount of these oats. He loves, loves, loves oatmeal. This kid could have a lot of it. And for the kids, they just like the whole milk yogurt with vanilla inside of it. It was really good just like that. And again, if I had chocolate chips, I would totally have added chocolate chips. It would have made it even more of a dessert. You guys, she's been ready for this probably like two months ago. This girl has been eyeballing the food. So I want to give her this before bed because she usually has like a bottle before bed because like usually around this time I would like, milk would be kind of low. Like she's been out for so long. So. I'm gonna give her some oatmeal, so hopefully that will fill her up in the night. And she'll knock out for long periods of time. Is that good? Give mommy a bite of hers so I can make more milk. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> She's spitting it out. Mm -hmm. Oh, I get the cute things. There's so many kids. I have like this whole room. Chilling and having a good